Federal Inland Revenue Service says it has increased the Nigeria's tax to uh, GDP ratio from 6% to 10.86% in 2022. Director of Taxpayer Services, FRS Abuja, Mrs. Saidat Yero, disclosed this at a sensitization program of the Lagos Midland West region of the FRS in Lagos. Mrs. Yero added that the primary objective of the program is to inform, sensitize, and educate consultants and taxpayers, as well as prioritize a customer centric approach, recognizing taxpayers as key stakeholders uh, within the tax ecosystem and facilitate compliance without hindrances. The tax format solution is the solution introduced by the service to make it easy for taxpayers to file in their returns, pay their taxes, and also to interact with the Federal Inland Revenue Service, even as the comfort of their houses and offices. We enlightened taxpayers as to the reason why we are here. We also highlighted what the services have, the Federal Inland Revenue Service has introduced to make tax payment easier for the taxpayers. We noticed when we uh, relate to some taxpayers or consultants, they don't really understand that things have changed. They don't understand the new things that have been introduced. They don't understand what we're doing with the tax program system. They don't understand what we are doing with the Finance Act since 2019. We said, okay, this is an avenue for us to expose to them what we're doing. The changes to the Capital Gains Tax Act, especially the issues of uh, the issues of setting off losses on the same class of assets, which were not in the law before. Hitherto, if you have a loss on the certain class of assets, and you have a gain or profit on another class of assets, the tax authorities will tax the gain, but the law goes. But now, government has made it so that your losses can be set off against the gains, and even the gains can be rolled over to subsequent years.